Guys, today I'm going to share it with you my bochi just for ingredients glutinous flour, red beans, sesame seed, and sugar. So, here is my red beans. I boiled it until soft and mash it, add with the sugar. It depends on your taste. If you want sweet, you can add more sugar. So, I add this red beans with Triple cup of sugar. Then, when it makes it well, set it aside. Then, glutinous flour, added with half cup of sugar. Then, added also with two cups of warm water. Mix it, mix it well until soft dough. Then take some portions, something like that. Okay, so here we go, guys. Take some portions of our gluttonous dough and add some red bean paste in the middle, close it, roll up, and dip it into sesame seed. If you want a little bit smaller than this, you can do it. You can see that, guys, how easy it is. Easy, you know.
So here we go guys, I have here a deep frying pan with a cooking oil and I keep it to be hot. We are not putting the bochi if our cooking oil still cold, should be hot. And when it is so hot, okay, turn to the medium heat to avoid burning and uncooked inside. So, to be cooked at all and cooked very well, we should level or medium heat. We need a medium heat. So, here we go. The best, you know, favorite or a favorite snack. sweet and yummy so delicious this guys actually if you are on tight okay i will not let you are advisable to eat this but don't eat it every day it is you know deep frying and carbohydrate so if you are on diet especially using a keto diet you could not eat this so done look at that yes okay when those are popping okay So our favorite snack, bochi, is ready to serve. Here we go guys, perfect. Look at that, light golden. So guys, don't forget to subscribe, Vel99, the baking tutorial.